today on presenting a documentary about an up and coming young golfer, Cameron Pollard, who his golfing career is on the rise. His journey is taking off. Now I speak to Kate Pollard, the proud mother of Cameron Pollard. Where was Cameron born and how old is he now? So Cameron was born in, here in Coffs Harbour and he's now 20 years old. What are Cameron's disability and can you please explain them? Sure, so uh, Cameron has a number of disabilities. So the first one and probably the most significant would be his autism. So that affects him in ways around the way he connects with people and interacts with people. So sometimes he doesn't read their emotions and um, he's a bit self-absorbed. So unless it's all about him, he doesn't really care. Um, he also has a bowel condition called Hirschsprung's disease. So he's had to have his bowel removed and now he has a stoma to manage his bowels. And he also has a condition called Ehlers-Danlos Syndrome. So it's a connective tissue disorder and it causes his joints to dislocate. So he's had to have a couple of knee repairs. What have been some of Cameron's greatest achievement? Oh, well, he's had a number of great achievements. Um, more recently, so we just came back from Macau where he won the world titles over in Macau. Uh, just late last year, he was selected for Australia for, as one of the 12 top golfers in the world um, to represent Australia in the All Abilities um, Australian Open. What makes you proud to be Cameron's mum? Uh, I would say just seeing him mature over the last few years into um, a pretty strong young man that um, is determined and passionate about what he does in the game of golf. Thank you Kate Pollard. Now I'm going to ask a few questions to Brendan Barnes, coach of Cameron Pollard. Where do you see Cameron's future in the sport? Our goal it, between the both of us is to get him down to a handicap of zero, scratch golfer, and he's, he fluctuates between two and three at the moment. So where that leads I don't know. He hasn't talked about becoming a golf professional or anything, but he wants to be involved in golf. Your highlights while coaching Cameron? There's been a few, and but my highlight with him would have to be caddying for him last year in Melbourne um, when he represented Australia uh, in the World Cup of golf, which was amongst the world's best players. They put the All Abilities event with it as well, and to be alongside him was just amazing, amazing experience for both of us. Funniest moment while coaching Cameron? I, and this this one's a bit regular, on a Tuesday, uh, on a, sorry, on a Wednesday afternoon, he plays 18 holes of competition uh, on every Tuesday at Sawtell Golf Club. And on the Wednesday, my shop manager, Clint, um, sits down with him and they've got this little thing about doing Cameron stats for Tuesday. He won't do the golf lesson unless Clint finds the time to sit down with him for that hour and do his stats. And he just won't do it. He won't. He said, no, nope, not doing it. No, nope. I have to get these stats done first, then I can talk to you, and then we can do the golf lesson, which I find bizarre, and that's, that's the way he is. Mm. Thank you, Brandon Barnes. No problem. Now a few questions here with Cameron Pollard. When did you start playing golf? I started playing golf when I was four years old. What do you enjoy about playing golf? The enjoyment of uh, playing well. Um, it's the best part of the game. When did you get your handicap? I got my handicap when I was 12 years old. And what, and what was it then? It was 27 then. And, uh, and what are you off now? It was, I'm off two now. Funniest memories to do with golf? Uh, when I was at the Australian Open, I was on the practice green or in the practice, the short game area. I uh, was hitting bunker shots and I hold my first bunker shot. Then I hit another shot and I bladed it over the other side of the green, nearly killed the pro and it went up into the corporate boxes on the 18th. I think Cameron is a great example of what people with a disability can achieve when you focus on their ability, not their disability. I like to wish Cameron the best in his golfing career. When did... Hello, Cameron Pollard. Hello, Joshua. Nice. Thanks, Cameron. Nice. Yep. Stop. David, stop it. I like to wish my best with 